Okay, let's see who's up next. Hi, Mayor. The National Weather Service just designated Washington Township as storm ready. Can you let the residents know about it? Well, Corporal Gersick, it sounds like you just did, but I'll elaborate because this really is a big deal. Because of our dedication to effective management of weather-related hazards and situational awareness, the National Weather Service and the New Jersey Storm Ready Advisory Board have designated Washington Township as Storm Ready. I, for one, believe that 24-7 emergency management and preparedness 911, where's your emergency? should be available to all residents and members of our community. It's critical to prepare for the unthinkable, those events that can cause extensive damage or otherwise disrupt a community. Having an in-depth strategy for emergency response, public notification, and your emergency is communication and potential evacuation are some of the key elements that helped us earn the Storm Ready distinction. This is a rather prestigious distinction. Washington Township now stands company with just 1,264 communities in the whole country who are named Storm Ready. This designation is valid for three years, plus the township could now get a percentage reduction in our annual flood insurance rates. The National Weather Service notes that Storm Ready communities are better prepared to save lives from the onslaughts of severe weather through better planning, education, and awareness. So hats off to Washington Township's Emergency Management Coordinator, Corporal Frank Gersick, who applied for the Storm Ready certification after completing National Weather Service coursework at the New Jersey State Police. Next up is another of Washington Township's finest to update us with a community policing success story in one of our neighborhoods. Hello, I'm Sergeant Billy from the Community Response and Training Unit of the Washington Township Police Department. Uh, earlier this year, uh, Chief Munez and Captain Connett uh, had a proactive enforcement initiative uh, take place within, within the department. Um, we were given a team of officers um, to go out and to problem solve and target these specific locations. Um, to determine a problem area, um, we go some, through some problem solving techniques. We got residents uh, complaints, officers intelligence, calls generated, and crime mapping techniques. Um, as a result of that, Birches West uh, was one of them areas. Uh, we had a lot of quality of life violations, uh, including uh, narcotics, disorderly conduct, traffic enforcement, and others. Uh, we came up with problem solving techniques uh, to make this area a, a safer place for the community. Uh, for instance, we used bike patrol, saturation patrol, and foot patrols. Um, as a result, the outcome was successful. Um, we had a lot of residents with positive feedback and reference uh, to our police presence um, in the Birches West community. In the fall of this year, Mayor Moriarty had a coming to your neighborhood meeting uh, in Birches West, and they also uh, were very pleased with the police presence and the enforcement uh, within this community. One of the residents at that point wanted to initiate a town watch program. Currently, we are in the process of organizing that meeting for January of 2008. Well, great work, Sergeant Lee, and all of the officers who had a part in improving the safety and quality of life of residents in the Birches West and throughout town. 